What's happening peeps and peep ants? I hope you guys are having an awesome day. In this video we are going to take a closer look at making a new Gemini character for my account. Now something weird is happening. I don't know, maybe you guys can help me out. Uh, whenever I move my camera in the front of the character, you guys can see it is getting really really dark uh, around my character. There is some kind of like weird texture and when I'm behind my character there is like a uh it goes to normal it goes basically it lights up the entire surroundings when i do it like this it goes slowly and then it turns to blackish i don't know what is going on i haven't touched any of my settings i don't know if you guys have the same um <laughs> problems difficulty whatever it is called uh as i am currently um getting on my character but just to show you guys that my like display everything has been set to max and everything is uh to its full uh capabilities of my graphics card everything is like you know on high and stuff like that advanced i have no idea what's going on maybe you guys can shed some light to that because i need some light in my <laughs> on my character but anyway this video is going to do um i'm actually going to make a gemini character and i'm also going to play the first mission um of the uh gemini uh, uh faction gemini storyline so uh i was thinking about getting these ships the Vanguard pack and all the way to the bottom and actually says note the Jemadar Vanguard ships are initially all for Jemadar captains only so I cannot display these things uh, I basically need to make a Jemadar character uh, grab these ships level them to level 6 uh, like they said right here once they have unlocked their tier 6 mastery skills the ship can be flown in any captain on the account so I Basically, only that, like, you know, my main account, Don Sakura, has, like, you know, the shield visuals and all that good stuff. Or the, the rest, I don't really spend a lot of time. Well, basically, the Klingons and one Romulan character that I have uh, that are basically equal to uh, Sakura when it comes to items. So, I cannot display all of these uh, good-looking ships until I leveled all each and every one of these guys to level 6. And to do that... I need a Jemadar character. So that is what we are going to do and going to take care in this video. So I'm going to go right now to the character creation uh, screen. Now, uh, you guys also as well should get like a new character slot or a free character slot so you can make a, a Jemadar character. And... Uh, hold on. So wait a minute. 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 I'm doing something wrong. If I don't buy the pack, I'm not going to have access to the Vanguard uh, Jem'Hadar. So I need to buy the pack, make a Jem'Hadar uh, character. Let me just do that right here. So um, there was one comment saying that uh, you probably need to buy the starter pack first and then you're going to get the tactical uniform and then you can buy the other one. But in the big one, there is also a... Um, tactical uniform in here as well so there is no need to buy the starter pack and then the vanguard pack everything that's like in the starter pack is already included in the vanguard pack so um i'm just gonna buy the vanguard pack i mean uh, if you look at you're gonna get the dreadnought cruiser uh, the playable vanguard species it's definitely up there the gemini tactical uniform two titles victories life plain and simple so, uh, cruiser, uh, tactical uniform, uh, the Vanguard, obviously, playable Gemini Vanguard, and two uh, titles, plain and simple, and victory's life. So, basically, I'm going to grab this thing, buy it for a 13k a zen. Yes, sir. Gimme, gimme, gimme. All right. Um, what just happened? Environmental suit, title, plain, and hold on. That went too fast. Cloud block. Uh, private. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? There we go. Uh, so we got Gamma Vanguard, plain and simple. Okay, so these are just the um, the titles that we got. That's awesome. Thank you. Thank you, Cryptic, for making it possible for us to buy the starter pack with Zen. Definitely enjoy that. Now let's go and make a playable Gemhadar character for my account. 
Now, some of you might like it, some of you might not like what I'm doing. I hope you guys like it. Definitely going to go with tactical on this guy. Um, engineering and science is something that does not hold my interest as this moment. But... Uh, mm, head. All right. One, two, three... What I'm usually what I usually do is I just go random till I find something that I really enjoy looking at. All right, that's good. One tube, no, two tubes. Um, skin complexity, no, that's fine. Eyes, the eyes. Uh, okay, I cannot change the eyes. Uh, head attachment. Oh, that is something I definitely want to play around with. These, ooh, I like that. The cranium one. Vanguard ridges. I think I'm, I think I'm gonna go with with this one, with the fourth one. Lots of spike crest. I like that as well. Cranium two. Oh, I definitely love that. Kind of looks that like this guy has like an owl on his uh, on his forehead. These are like you know the eyes and his nose. Oh, that's so cool. Um, I don't know. I don't know. Choices, choices. Yeah, this one. This one it is. Hairstyle. All right, hairstyle. Ugh. No, no way. I think I'm going to go with this one. Or this one. So two or five. I'm going to go with the standard five. Uh, mouth accessories. Definitely going to give these guys some spikes. But not too much. Yeah, like that. All right. That's that's good. I might finish this guy later um, off screen, uh, make some interesting adjustments for now. Um, yeah. Yeah, cancel that. All right. For now, this is uh, how it is and how we, this guy is going to look like because I really don't want to bother you guys too much with. Um, why is it on female uh, male? Yeah. Can we do female? Did I undo everything? Oh my god, I did. Uh, yeah, this, the, sorry guys, sorry, sorry, sorry. I think I was five, right? Yeah. Uh, jaws were the second to last. Sorry, 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 sorry. Uh, anyway, um... Yeah, this one was good because I like the owl on his head. Uh, uniform, yeah, I'm not going to touch that. Let's go with background. Some kind of random name that I might even enjoy. Um, Toledzan. Amata Tlan Amata Tlan Amata Tlan Amata Tlan Sekura Maratang Sekura uh, with a small C or with a big T ATC all right middle name Sekura ship name is gonna be randoms victory 130 Week three, 360. How about that? 360 degrees. Engage. All right. So that was um, my character that I'm going to do the playthrough with. Now, this is the cutting.
can't win through force of arms. Deception, stealth, and misdirection will help us stay alive. We will use any means necessary to defeat this enemy. Always remember, victory is life. How about that for a cutscene, right? Oh, more. Several containment cells at this penal installation have been breached. A number of prisoners are attempting to escape. Their likely destination is the shuttle facility and landing area. I hope you guys enjoyed that little part. That was just awesome. He's just nodded him like, go, go deal with that. <laughs> That's crazy. Oh, my character is a little bit off standing like that. Okay, I think it was on the ridge right here. Okay, so um, yeah, we kind of saw this cutscene on the triple and I definitely enjoyed it with the voice animation and all of the effects have been added to it. That's just awesome. But something that we did not do is the mission itself. So the mission, uh, I'm going to place the map right here where I want it to be. So meet up with the beta squad, hunt down a group of escaped prisoners. I read that correctly? Yes, prisoners. Alrighty. Um, okay, so I'm going this way, I'm guessing. Wait a minute. Uh, Alright, so... Yeah, I'm going to do that off screen. I was thinking about making a, uh, a key binding, but it's not something that I want to bother you guys with. Very awesome looking map. Definitely has like, you know, that prison vibe. The big tower where you can actually see all over the place. What is these? These are Cardassians? Hurry, you're gonna be left behind. Oh, you... Just started combat right here. Okay, I'll kick you guys butts. Okay, so this might be like a tutorial for the playable Jim Hadar. What is this guy? <gasps> I've fallen Jim Hadar. All right. Rest in peace, comrade. All right, here we go. Next a little stop. But why are there Cardassians? Get up! Run! I'm going to shoot you guys in the back. Stop running. Face me. Okay, well, don't then. What was here? Any any secrets? Any unlockable th accolades? No. Well done. Whoa. You drove the escapees into our fortified position. Victory is life. Our guard unit was decimated during the breakout. We should form a new squad and deal with the remaining escapees. The honor of leadership should be yours. I accept. Follow me. Wow. Right away. Whoa. How many did I get? I got two? Two or one? I think there are two, yeah. One is holding a pistol, the other one is a rifle. Cool. Come with me, brothers. I know the way. What are these things? Just rocks. Oh, uh, I also got Cut to Sell White right here, so that's definitely awesome. Consumed by Jimadar gives me plus 10% to all uh, damage for the next 5 minutes, 20% max hit points, and also 25% the maximum run speed. Definitely gonna use that right now. Gimme, gimme, gimme. 
Okay, Four let's... escapees ahead. They have yet to detect our presence. I recommend we keep it that way. We should activate Shroud uh, to gain the advantage. Activate Shroud now. Uh, is it this thing? Yeah. For 60 seconds. Excellent. Now you can make a surprise assault. All right. Nothing Twit. useful in here. We should keep moving. But these guys are visible. Why didn't these guys like cloak with me? Okay, what do I do now? So I do I do crouching, I do No you Well there goes my surprise. Who would did that? Who did that? I will kill you. Was it you? You disobeyed me. You made my shroud go away. Check for life signs. Who was they? What were they were doing here? I love these new crates that they put up here. With a, it kind of looks like a Jemadar icon, but it's not. Loving it. Okay, these guys are dead. Is there anything else to do up here? I want to surprise these guys. Oh yeah, flanking bonus. Take Oh, what is that? What is she holding? Give me that. She was holding some kind of like spiky thing. Oh, hold on. My map. Oh, okay, so I need to go that way. Okay. Another Gemidar that's fallen. Okay. I'm kind of looking for accolades and stuff like that. They usually have like some kind of like secret path that you An can take. Dose of White provides a temporary boost. I already got that. Give me cloak. And you guys should cloak with me, man. That's not fair. Wait a minute, Orions? What are Orions doing in this way? A large number of prisoners are escaping the facility and heading your way. Stop them. Oh no. Okay. Nice. Okay, so basically hold off all of these guys from reaching the shuttle and you can definitely use this awesome looking gun. I can also use security team to beam out. Hey, that's the Romulan transport beam in uh, visuals. I've seen enough computer and what this thing was a Program continue. Remember, victory is life. I know. Gimme. Talk to Echo Ixten. Your leadership skills are sound. I am Echo Ixten, and I would be honored to follow you in battle. I offer my service to your unit. Nice, I accept your offer. Come with me. So this guy's probably gonna be like my uh, bridge officer. Hope oh, didn't see you there. Rem Tar uh, Rem Taral Taral Tarak. You fight well. I see now why the honored elder chose you for this duty. I am Rem Taral. It would be good to serve under your command. I offer my services to you and your unit. Your offer is accepted. The victory is life. 
More? No, this is a well executed operation. You showed initiative and inspired others to follow your lead and achieve success. Your promotion to first is all but assured. All that remains is confirmation from the Vorta commander. I will take you to him now. Follow me. As you say, Arnold Elder. Wow, so this is basically the inside of a Gemini ship. Nice. I don't think we got a chance to see this in the TV show. Looks cool. There is definitely not an ounce of fat on this thing, so it's basically just functional for everything. Nice. Got Gemini consoles that way. Okay, talk to this guy again. Take this turbo lift to the bridge. You are to speak to the Vorta known as Wayun. He awaits you there, along with his adjutant, Loris, and a founder. I trust you appreciate the need to report to the lead Vorta as soon as possible. He is not the only one evaluating you. Understood. Nice, I'm liking the tutorial so far. All right. To the bridge it is. Um, this is not the bridge. This is basically just a corridor. Maybe this is like the bridge floor or something like that. Wait a minute. Put me on the map. So I need to go this way. All right. Hello. Door open. No. Okay. Other way around then. Prepare the fleet. We need to reach the Bajor system as soon as possible. Of course, Founder. We'll be ready for transit within the hour. Okay, so initially when I came in, I was thinking like this is like a bathtub, kind of looks like that. <laughs> like an empty bathtub, maybe Odo's bucket has been... Uh, <laughs> has been upgraded to a bathtub <laughs> but now that I look uh, look at it closely it's like a um, it's like a console basically thing like you can push buttons on it nice all right let's talk to Veyun welcome honored elder Dukon Rex speaks quite highly of you and after evaluating your latest performance I can see the praise is well earned I'm pleased to inform you that the Founders have chosen to bestow the rank of First upon you. May you continue to serve them well. This guy is awesome. I shall. I would expect no less. One more thing. The Founders, in their wisdom, have also granted you the right to report directly to them when necessary. To speak to your gods is quite an honor. Unexpected live in most unusual times oh that's so cool indeed the founders will contact you when they have need of your skills in the meantime i suggest you prepare yourself your unit and your ship for service speak with my adjutant loris four she'll help you prepare for the challenges ahead in the alpha quadrant remember victory is life victory is life Okay, talk to Loris. Greetings and congratulations on your promotion. I am Loris Four. I will help you maximize your efforts to bring glory to the founders. Head to the requisitions room across the hall. Someone will assist you. All right. While you're there, you may also wish to acquire a different vessel or switch the ship you'll command. Each ship requires certain bridge officers to function efficiently. Be certain you have the officers you need before heading out. Okay, that is something that is really interesting. Um, we never had this in the tutorial when we, were, when we were making Federation Klingons or Romulan characters. So this last part, be certain you have the officers you need before heading out. This is really interesting. So it basically tells you guys, um, set up your bridge officer before you're going to do, you know, all of the uh, cool combat. All right, continue. Report to Wayun when you are ready to depart. He will distribute the Ketracel White for your unit at that time. 
Oh, that's awesome. Understood. Exit the way you came in. Turn right, then head left and enter requisitions. What? She's basically giving me directions. All right. Turn right, and then left, and then enter requisitions. Requisitions. Acquire ships and ship manager. All right, let's go to acquire ships. Ship vendor. This guy is a Vorta as well. Congratulations on your promotion. Lotus has declared you to select a ship to command. There are several impressive vessels to choose from. Take a look at the store. The starships that are approved by rank are listed in there. If you, have if you have previously purchased other ships, you can gain access to them there. Browse starships that are approved for your rank. Oh, damn it, carrier. <gasps> I love this thing. Yep, buy ship for free. I don't even have to look at all of the other ones. You guys know I'm loving carriers, so I'm definitely going to choose that one. Uh, where did it go? Did it go in my inventory? Unlock this thing. Uh, Batch C Yankee. All right, let me just grab that and all of the items transferred from the starting one uh, to the uh, to the other ship. Okay, so looking at this thing, this thing does not have enough uh, engineering consoles to survive a lot. But it does have lots of science consoles. Okay. Alright, that's cool. Uh, so we need to go back to Veyun. Veyun, I'm ready! <laughs> I'm ready for combat. Okay, I was hoping for more uh, voiceover, but I guess I have to, uh, you guys have to do with my voice. Uh, ceremony, are you prepared for combat first? The founder has ordered the fleet to battle station. We will depart as soon as you are ready. I am soon and I'm ready. Can you vouch for the loyalty of your men? I pledge our loyalty to the founders uh, from now until death. Then receive this reward. Detecting a number of derelict vessels ahead on sensors. It looks like they ran afoul of some Idrin swarmers. How unfortunate. I believe this will be a teachable moment for our newly promoted first. Norris? <laughs> nice. Continue. I agree, of course. First, I'd like you to move ahead of the fleet and eliminate the swarmers. Take out the derelict vessels as well. They'll attract more vermin otherwise. It shall be done. All right, so the ooh, oh my god, look at this. Look at this armada right here, and I got the best looking ship out there. Oh, that is so cool. Um, but I what I don't not have is my bridge officers uh, set up. Mm, ish. All right, that's that's good enough for this mission, I guess. Uh, these things I need to spawn in. So let me just spawn in these guys first. Oh, nice. Look at that sound effect when we entered combat. The red alert kind of teal. Nice. That's like definitely from the TV show, the way it uh, sounded. That is cool. Um, so I don't know which one I want from these guys. Mm, where are... So those are just these, the vanguards. Let's 
structure reinforcement. But how do I get these guys? Oh, they're already out. Stupid me. Look at that. Two of them. Tag ship wingman. So I can basically choose what to do with these guys. Uh, go faster, please. Hey, we got a lockbox. Electric, er what was it said? Erosion? Oh, just the polar on unlock. <laughs> That's so cool. Oh, really nice basic cannon tech upgrade. I like that. Uh, which way do we go? All right, so I can basically go that way. Okay. Broken freighter. Uh, let's make these guys attack everybody. So this isn't really a good representation of combat in uh, STO, this, um, yeah, this is just basically tutorial kind of stuff. Wow, more basic upgrades? Okay. What is this? That's engineering team? Yep. Okay, so heal, heal. I don't have anything on this guy. Probably need to promote him a little bit. Yeah, not going to do that right now. Wait a minute, I want these guys out. Okay, so that is the detachable part of my ship. Do I need to... Now that is just linking them together. That's gravity, well, those are just skills. Okay. No, I got I got you guys covered. Don't worry about it. When I'm going to unlock these guys at quick deployment, armored hull, reactive shielding. Isn't there like a button for 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 deploying these guys? Okay, so we got a couple of new ones. So that is the craft that detaches from the ship. Those are just the uh, patterns that we can choose. Um, mm -hmm. Those are the gumbo, so that is that. This is just to link them up together. So this is to do like an attack vector on them. And this is like a heal me, basically. Go for support. Uh, alpha, beta, alpha, beta, alpha, beta. Okay. Hmm. And I went too far. Yeah, that's the detachable. Do I need to be level 61 or something? That is weird. Yeah, you guys are probably going to make like full comments about this part. I don't know. <laughs> At this part, I really don't know how to detach these guys. 
projectiles emotions gather near the wormhole entrance all right that's this one now i'm definitely going to make a review about this ship so i'm not showing it off a lot so stay tuned to the channel for that definitely going to make a uh, video on this All ships prepare for transit to the alpha quadrant is your vessel ready for the journey after your encounter with the swarmers? Yeah, I am ready. As of this moment, we are all dead. We go into battle to reclaim our lives. This we do gladly, for we are Jemadar. Remember, victory is life. Victory is life. Of course. There's a Zen Cafe battle station in this sector. Heavily damaged and in danger of being destroyed in combat. I need you to extract a high value target from it before that happens. The fleet will clear a path for you to the station. You will then beam down with an away team and escort Zen Cafe Admiral to the Zen Tower into safety. Understood. It will be done, Founder. Oh, I love this part. So they're basically I will make our intentions clear to the alliance before they open fire on us. What? The dominion is on our side. Can I talk now? Okay, good. So basically, we kind of did this mission uh I'm getting so many uh <laughs> accolades this is crazy. So basically we did this mission on the other side when we were playing like Federation uh, Klingons or whatever you were playing, the Romulan factions. Um, and at this moment when the uh, Gemini actually entered battle, you basically are going to do the same deal. So that's awesome. Okay, let me just kill all these guys. Okay, so what I needed to do is reach the St. Kathy um, Starbase, this thing. Beam we town. transporter range to the station first. Is your away team ready? Yes, it is ready. Beam us over. A full complement of Gemini bridge officers. Nice. Let us get there. Our senses have detected the Admiral. He is on the station's upper level in the command area. I recommend haste. The Herc are likely to overrun the station and soon. Find the Admiral and get him to safety. I'll update you once that happens. Acknowledged. All right, so basically we did this mission on, um, yeah, like I said, on the Federation. But I don't think the, the, the Dominion played a really big role in that. So this might be interesting what they're doing here right now. Oh, cutscene.
Oh my god. Oh, more of them. Oh man, these guys are going to give me nightmares. Use the site to site transporter. All right, let's do that. Uh, control deck. Oh, more Herc. I uh, think we got a little bit of a lag issue right here. Server not responding on the tops of your screen. Now, if that doesn't clear up, I'll have to restart. Yeah, let me just restart. All right, so here we go. We are back. These guys are here as well. Wow, this guy's taking a beating. How much hit point does he has? Oh, 900. Okay. Just my guns are not that good right now. They should be better, but I haven't had any. Uh... Okay, this way. Wait a minute. There is guys that I can kill off this guy this way. Open up. I want to kill guys. Oh, this guy's cloaked. So this guy have like. Okay, we all cloak. Okay, fine. Let's do a surprise attack. These guys are ugly. Look at these guys. Whoa, they're running really fast when they're with those legs. Why are you guys fighting? Some small bug. Okay. We got a Klingon that we need to talk to. Jen Hadar, here? If you come to help, you will be welcomed. If not, today is a good day to die for you. <laughs> the last part was really awesome. Uh, we're here for the Admiral. Alright, here they come. Whoa, look at that transporter. That is awesome. Got the really cool transporter animation, or these new ones. Nice. Come on, kill that guy. Stupid wall. I can't actually hit him. Because he's like behind this, this wall thingy. think we got him. There we go. Okay. Find the Admiral. Here we go. Admiral, talk to me. Nice. You will come with us. Very well. I have a war capable shuttle on the 
station near the escape pods. I'll give you access to that section. Take me to it. Come along, no tricks. That's awesome. Ooh, where are you going? I thought this guy was leading me. I have to lead him now. He is coming with us. Ah, okay. I love the Zenkevi, by the way. These guys are my favorite bad guys. Uh, so, yeah. Right here, take the right part where we weren't able to uh, go through first. Yep. Is the Admiral going to fight with us? Come on. Come on, fight, fight, Admiral. Show me what you got. There we go. Do your thing, baby. Subatomic alteration, all right. That's good. Level secure. We're needed elsewhere. Fight well. You've done well. My shuttle is not soldier. I can make it from here. My shuttle is just beyond this door. You're saying, ah, yes, victory is mine. <laughs> nice. Taking the Admiral out of harm's way. I expected nothing less from one of our finest. I have a new task for you first. Make your way to the torpedo bay and set one of the torpedoes there to detonate. That will take care of all the Herc on board quite nicely. Oh, Loris, you badass. All right, that it will be done. Um, all right, let's kill all these guys as well. That catcher's is still going, right? Yep. Okay. So this way, I guess. Hello? Come in peace. Okay. Talk to Commander Marin. Adar, huh? This day just gets more and more interesting. If you're here for a fight, you'll get one. But with all this proto matter around us, it might be brief. Uh, we are not your enemies. Fantastic. If you're not here to fight, I'm gonna assume you're here to help. We were about to disarm all these beauties. I'm sure you noticed this place is a little unstable. No one's thrilled with the idea of all this proto matter exploding. Want to give us a hand? I have orders to destroy right. the station. You figured a room full of proto matter would be the best way to make it go boom? Wonderful. Look, let's compromise. We'll neutralize the proto matter in all but one of these torpedoes, which you'll set to detonate. Everyone's happy. My team needs three minutes to get it done. You okay with this plan? <laughs> I will confirm. Nice. Three minutes it is. Hail Loris. Ah, the renowned Starfleet efficiency. Three minutes is an acceptable time frame. Let the good commander know we are agreeable to his terms. And first, don't tarry once the demolition task is complete. We require your skills in combat over Bejour. Nice, acknowledged. Yeah, I think it was something like this. So hold your point, basically.
Look at all of these torpedoes. Whoa, what's happening? Oh. Oh my god, this guy needs like 30 seconds for one stack. What is that thing will they usually bring out? I love those visuals. All right, two minutes left. All the other way. Run, 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 run. Oh, what is that? That's a guardian. Nice, this guy's dead. What's happening? Oh, we got other guys as well. Oh, what is that? Oh, yeah, he did that. They basically do like a charging thing. Kind of like that. They don't speak a lot. They just, you know, scream. Come on, engineer. Come on, Starfleet. Oh, that hurt. That hurt again. Oh. I'm getting flanked. Oh, stop it. Stop it. Oh, that got me like dizzy. Four biting stifler. Nice. Could you die? So if I had like my main character, these guys would be like wasted right now. A long, long time ago. But this guy is not. All right. I think Starfleet is done. Yeah, all right, all right. Hold your horses. We're good to go here. You want to push the big red button, or shall I? It is my duty to begin the detonation. Arm the torpedo. Right. <clears throat> Arm the torpedoes. Arm torpedoes. Go boom. Nice work. It's been interesting fighting with Jem'Hadar instead of the other way around. Well, command wants us somewhere else, so adios. Try not to get shot, yeah? Right. So I was right about this guy. This guy is an engineer because he's wearing a, um, a yellow shirt. All right. Victor is life. Uh, hail, Loris. Factor here first. We have need of you back in space. Are you prepared to leave the station? Yes, I am. Return to ship. well first i believe we are going to work together quite nicely all for the glory of the founders of course our main task lies ahead simply put we must save the alliance forces in this sector from the herc i trust you're up for the challenge <laughs> the herc will fail all right this thing should go boom any minute now oh look at that explosion i love that very bright all right, so these wingmen are Full out right now. They're much easier to hit that way.
Okay, I don't get this. Are these my wingmans or are these somebody else's wingmans? I don't know. Target the Herc forces and fire. Target the Herc forces and fire, he said. Where are the Herc forces? All right, straight ahead. Oh, there they are. Sorry. <laughs> Did not see you guys. All right. To a strafing run. Whoa, where did they go? Seed of success. Klingon ships. Save the Klingon ships. Oh, I need to go there. Uh, evasive maneuvers. Atomic attrition. Nice. Okay, they're fully unlocked now. Uh, Alright, so you can attack and you just do support, I guess. Or heal me up. I know, I've been fighting my entire hey, life. We're barely holding on here. Can anyone help? A Starfleet vessel is in trouble. Assist them. Uh, Starfleet. These guys are always in hell trouble. He just got blown up. Stop pushing him near the planet, dude. That's not good. Bad Jem'Hadar. Bad, bad Jem'Hadar. Uh, kill these guys. Please kill them. Also detach. Torpedo target, adjusting anti-gravity. Wow, so many. Uh... Uh, no, I don't want to scan. Fight alongside the Klingons or Starfleet. Another well-fought victory first. You continue to impress. I know, right? I'm first. <laughs> I live to serve the founders. And the founders want you to serve alongside the alliance as part of their defensive forces. There are two viable factions to consider: the Federation and the Klingon Empire. It's indulgent, I know, but I think the final choice should be yours. Who shall it be? Uh wow, already I have to make a decision. I'm ready. <gasps> Choose your ally. Oh, this guy is looking badass, man. Starfleet explores the star and defends the United Federation of Planets from threats. Starfleet officers are dedicated to advancing the Federation knowledge of the galaxy, exploring strangers, seeking out new life 
and new civilization to boldly go where no man has gone before. Or the Klingons. The Klingons' defense force represent the military might of the Klingon Empire. The KDF officers serve the uh, conquering new worlds, battling the Empire's enemies and undertaking scientific and exploration mission that will expand the Klingons' reach, the Empire's reach. In return, they gain the glory and honor that a true warrior deserves. Yeah, I'm thinking I'm going to go with Starfleet on this guy. Yeah, let's go with Starfleet. Picking the Starfleet as your ally will grant all... Uh, we grant you access to Starfleet locations such as Airspace, Stark, Starfleet Academy. You will be able to team up with Starfleet captains and fly Federation uh, Starfleet uh, Starship if you so choose. While you are still a member of the Dominion, you will also have the right to Starfleet officer. Once you made it, this is there is no coming back. Do you still want to become an ally of Starfleet? Yes. Go for it. Answer Hill. I think you'll fit in well there eventually. It might take some time to get used to the way they operate, but I believe you're ready for the challenge. Yes, founder. This meeting is classic. You are one of a special breed, chosen by the Founders for great things. To that end, we will supply you with special gear and training. Use this transponder to directly contact us on a secure channel. I expect regular reports, especially regarding unusual developments. And do remember, victory is life. Gamma recruit. Okay, so the last cutscene that you guys saw, that's a bug that should be like, I don't know, some kind of NPC that we talked to. I think it was Loris's uh, voiceover right there. Uh, server not responding again. Oh, that's not good. Oh, it is. Back up. Okay. So, uh, yeah, there was a cutscene. Uh, so I am like a Gamma recruit uh, on this uh, character. We pledged our allegiance to the Federation and that cutscene was a little bit buggy. There should be like an NPC there. But um, let's depart system. How do I depart system? Where is the button? This one, you have completed all your objectives in the area. Do you want to leave the system? Okay. So normally there's a button right here to leave. Oh, here we go. <laughs> it's right there. Wow, look at me. All right, depart. Right through uh, DS9. Taking a pylon with me or two. <laughs> nice. Wow, accolades. Yeah. All right, so that was the first mission. I hope you guys did not have a lot the of... The Alliance has agreed to a summit meeting with us to discuss the return of the Herc and what can be done to prevent their aggression from devastating all four galactic quadrants. Despite recent events, they've agreed to host the summit at Deep Space Nine. I'm not surprised. None of the galactic powers are comfortable hosting a Dominion fleet deep within their territory. Meet with me at DS9 prior to the beginning of the summit. I'd like to discuss our options. Now we already did this mission. It's already up on the YouTube channel of mine. So if you want to, if you want to see a playthrough of that mission, uh, take a look at all of my uh, videos that I've done. But just to recap, I hope you guys had a little bit of fun with this thing because it's definitely cool to uh, play this kind of tutorial. Basically, it sets the tone for the things to come. Uh, obviously, you guys saw me choose the uh, Federation side, so Earth Space Dock is unlocked. Um, all kinds of you know location where the where the Federation can go on this character is unlocked. Uh, I needed to do that because I also wanted to display like shield visuals and stuff like that on this character. So that is definitely cool. And I also want to take a look at this. Um, is it this thing? The Dominion Transponder that they actually gave me. Um, so activate to open the Gamma Recruitment User Interface. This will be used to track your progress through the Gamma Recruitment event. This, this device cannot be sold or discarded. Wow. Okay. So we are definitely going to take a closer look at these. The following. 
uh, reach when you reach 65 activating this item will grant your energy credit reputation dilithium expert uh, expertise as well as 250 marks of each of your uh, uh, following uh, reputation marks so you can basically choose uh, what is this one complete a queue Activating this item will get a small amount of expertise as well as 50 of any of the following reputation marks. Nice. What is this? So 125 Qs. Okay, and 100 Qs. So this one is complete, right? There is a check mark right there. Uh, specialization. So when you spend specialization points, I didn't reckon um okay so one of them 5 15 30 and 90 across the board additionally we'll log the following starship traits by spending 15 so dominion teams unconventional tactics arrest wow that's cool so basically just like the delta recruitment you're also going to get a transponder uh, thingy so you can activate anywhere you are and this should unlock for all of your uh, other characters as well. Wow, so that's so cool. Um, 15, Gamma Recruitment. Yeah, nice. What else, what else? R&D. A White Specialist Duty Officer. Uh, green Research Lab Scientific uh, uh, Science Duty Officer. This should be like a um, R&D school of 10. You may, you may not choose the school of which you are already above level 10. If all around you are correct above level 10, you will increase the of, of large crafting XP pool. Nice. I like that. That's not bad. Activating the very uh, purple Aegis Specialist Duty Officer. So you can basically craft your own Aegis space set with this Duty Officer. Very nice. Uh, an enhanced universal tech upgrade and uh, if you go all the way re-engineer a mark of 15 items activity will grant you a large salvage pack as well as account unlock of an extra salvage pack bonus pool admirality One Admiralty campaign as a Gamma Recruit activate 10 random one-time Admiralty ships and 5 Admiralty assignment pass tokens. That's so good. Um, so when you reach one tier at uh, level 10. Uh, two of them at level 10. Admiralty ships, uh, pass tokens, and some dilithium. Otto's a flagship Admiralty card, pass tokens, one time use, some dilithium. Reputation as well. Wow. So, mark of choice, elite marks, reputation uh, project, dilithium vouchers, energy credits, uh, three of them. More marks, more of the same, I guess. One million energy credits. Five million energy credits. Two stacks of five, 30k dilithium. Wow, but not bad. Definitely need to spend some more time on this guy. Um, gamma recruitment commenda uh, commendation category i'm just gonna go th really quickly through these things just to see uh what's special about them uh gamma recruitment level three five very rare a quadrant um quadra officers very nice Gamma Quadrant Duty Officers, a gold one. Uh, I wish they actually gave us some more details of what this gold character would actually do. Let me just move a little bit away from all of these guys because they are like leveling up and it's like on the back uh, background. It's not really cool. 
Uh, there's also something for the fleet. So 500 fleet marks, 50k uh, fleet only dilithium. Not bad. 60 fleet, uh, 600 fleet marks, 60k fleet only dilithium. And what is this? 500 clear fleet credits, 70, uh, 700 fleet marks, 70k fleet only dilithium. And also episodes. Here are the options in the Elder First during the event of a storm cloud. So these are going to be unlocked with the various episodes that they um, just released, but you have to do them on the um, on your Gamma uh, Quadrant uh, character, the Gemhadar ones. Very nice, very cool. I like it. The tutorial is awesome. Um, gives you a little bit of a background story of like why the Gemini are here. Uh, also, a really awesome to um, you know to make your own uh, choice right away. So you're definitely going to have to do that. That's awesome. And uh, yeah, that's it for this playthrough. I hope you guys had a little bit of fun me creating a Gemini character. Also choosing the faction and I would love to see you guys on the next video. Hoping you guys had a little bit of fun and entertainment coming out of the channel. And um, yeah, see you on the next video. Take care guys. Later.